Welcome guys, in this tutorial we will see how to install map server uh, for windows. So first you need to go to this map server for windows official site and get the download. Download this uh, zip file or setup executable file. After you download it you can extract this uh, file and you will find uh, the folder structure visible to this for keep uh, running map server you also need uh, the apache as the web server because map server is itself uh, the map engine map generating engine so it needs a web server to communicate so you need uh, here Apache server, I am using Apache as my web server so you can install Apache uh, in a simple way like uh, using XAMPP or WAMP server so after you have uh, installed Apache just uh, move to this uh, Apache CGI bin folder Here I am using exam. In exam, there is a folder called uh, CGI bin. This is where we should uh, put all the CGI scripts. So the map server is also uh, uh, a script running in CGI environment. So now you need to copy the content from your uh, map server for windows uh, for the cgi bin contents you need to uh, copy all these files just select all files control a and control c now copy these files into your web server cgi bin folder so yes uh, this is the location that you need to uh, copy if any file is there uh, you just need to replace all the existing files so here in my uh, cj bin folder already the map server files are there so i do not need to uh, redo this most probably you may need to replace this print uh, print so uh, print environment file it's just safe to replace so after copying these files now you can run a uh, map server in your machine and you can run map files to make sure the map server is okay the installation is okay you can You can go to this uh, URL for your map server. All right. I'm sorry, there's some typo in my URL, so it should be uh, mapserv.exe, the correct URL, something like this mapserv.exe and just run this so if you get uh, this message that means your map server installation is fine so, so thank you for watching this tutorial in the next tutorial we will see how to run map files how to render map files using our map server thank you